Well, going people, you don't know it's your girl Ivani, and I'm here for the first time with my YouTube video. I know somebody telling us I'm going to make a vlog video about prison, you know that one is coming up soon. But this morning, I'm going to make a video about a skincare product that I got from Modern V. I'm just going to show you guys how I apply my skincare on my face, and I'm going to tell you guys. How many times you use it how it's supposed to be used so stay tuned and let's get started and remember to click the subscribe button like share and comment thank you yeah people so I am back and ready so we're actually gonna start by washing our face with our bright and nice clean face cleanser I'm gonna wash my face two times my inside bathroom is actually being occupied so you know i'm using the outside bathroom well i don't have an outside bathroom i mean where i wash clothes i'm gonna wash my face as you guys can see i have an uneven skin tone because of bleaching and i have a lot of spots what the cleanser do is help you to get your skin even help to get all of those little light spots off so i'm gonna wash my face with the cleanser Just massage it into your skin, over your eyes, your forehead. I have um my, I have um, what you call that? My burnt mark in my face, so that's why my face look really black. So some people feel like say I bleach, but me still so no, I have a burnt mark in my face. Oh, I'm gonna know why I'm gonna stop my break and wash my face. I feel like my dad, you know, I'm gonna go nice No, I'm gonna pat it a little bit. Just pat it a little bit like that. Ooh. And then I'm gonna go in and use my pat on milk. But guess what, guys? Let me turn this around for a second. Normally, after washing my face with the cleanser, right? Normally, after washing my face with the cleanser, I would have go ahead and use the scrub. The, yes, it's just called sugar scrub. I would have go ahead and use the scrub but reason being the scrub supposed to use three times for the week I already used it last night so I wouldn't need to use it again so what I'm going to use next is the milk so what we do after washing the face with the cleanser we're going to apply the milk onto the face let it stay about five to eight minutes or whenever it has this it's gonna have this sticky feeling like it's gonna let your face feel stiff or whenever the, the milk just dry up on your face itself, that's when you wash it off. So, I'm actually going to apply milk to my face right now. And then, you don't have to do it in a little stush or in a little neat way. You can just do it however you please. Basically, this is it. Talks like a bunny on me. Why? Me use a lot of stuff, you know. That's just me. Some more to work for us, but okay, I'm not gonna use it. Mm -hmm. And you just rub it all over. The eye you feel like it's having some some of those luck on it. Well, I right. So what I do is I actually rub the milk onto my face. That's it. Make sure you rub it all over your face. See? 
it actually smells good it actually feels good so guys as you can see I stop the bleaching and all of that but what happened now don't watch this black thing in my face that will never come out and I care how I bleach it it never come out it's just that I'm um uh, what do you call it this is my I don't remember the name but you guys know what I'm talking about and as you can see I have uneven skin tone I also have pimples in my face and I have a broad lips you know for if my crush wanna kiss me I'm <laughs> sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry and yeah as you see and mothers have an uneven skin tone so actually the milk I think the milk will just help to just suck out any little pimple any little dark spot and all those stuff it doesn't really help with dark spot because I do have a dark spot remover but yeah so as I say I'm just gonna stay here and wait for it to dry and then I wash it up what can I do while I let it dry I don't even know but yeah mm -hmm. it's actually getting stiff on my face it's actually feeling very 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 stiff you know I have a little bit so I gotta let my skin tone and I love the way I look like everybody's telling me that I burn you don't need to bleach your skin tone looks so beautiful but never know if you are still look pretty with your natural complexion why you ever bleach in the first place why you take out your piercings then what's the reason for that or you just decide that you just want to change so you just take them out I'm not gonna tell no lie deep down within myself I feel more comfortable one time I never used to feel comfortable with my natural complexion because I always just say you know, I'm gonna see the beauty. I'm not gonna feel pretty. Yet see my dark, but different from who grew with me, who live in my community. But my whole fan base never really see my dark, and I just never like to see my normal complexion because I don't see the beauty. I'm always saying, you no, know, I'm gonna bleach myself. Cause when I bleach, I have this brown look. I have this sweeter look. I just look prettier. I'm gonna feel like I'm be prettier to everybody eyes. But then. When I got locked up and I was over the prison, I'm not getting a bleaching cream for use. I'm over there for a period of time and I actually get a lot of compliments like from the officers there, most the officers them and yeah, inmates. And everybody said to me, say, Ivani, you look so beautiful without bleaching. You're not supposed to bleach. And I remember this officer by the name of Miss Berry. She always said to me, say, Ivani, no more bleaching. You look so beautiful with your complexion. That you're not even, you don't need to bleach, not even tone. Because I said to her, I said, I'm not going to bleach. And I'm going to come out, I'm going to tone. And she said to me, say, don't tone. Because when you tone, it's going to give you this brown complexion. And you're going to want to get even whiter. So don't even bleach, not tone or nothing. Just keep it normal. And I said to her, I said, if that's one thing I can promise somebody and promise myself, say, I'm not going to bleach. And then I don't know if I show me a ear to compliment them. I come in every day, every day. I say, no man, you know, so I'm really pretty. And every morning I get up and I'm looking at the mirror. I say, I'm not going to ever bleach myself. I'm going to promise myself that I'm not going to bleach. And I say, with a dark complexion, I don't need all these piercing because look at me now. I'm this dark person with a lot of piercing. As you can see, I have all there. I have all there. I have all there. And I pierce there. My ears are pierced. I don't need no more. I did have a smile. I did have embraces. So I said that is too much. When you look bleach out and you have a lot of piercing, you attract certain friends to you. You attract certain companies. You attract certain, you know, certain, certain niggas to be on a date in you. But when you're dark, you have your normal complexion. You're just being you. You take out all the piercing. You seem to attract different type of people. You attract more of a modern type, more of a classy. You know, I'm more of a peaceful minded people to you. I'm not going to tell a lie. Since I kind of get my normal complexion, I'm going to take out all piercing. I seem me, 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 me have more business person coming toward me. A lot of persons want to do video shoot. A lot of persons want to do photo shoot. A lot of persons don't want me to add for them. A lot of persons don't want me to model their clothes. A lot of persons want me to be ambassador. But then when I did bleach out and I bleach in, I never see none of them opportunities that come my way. So, all of this is just a change and it's just a start over and it's just a brighter future ahead of me and i see myself with a 
spray seems it up braces may just look more prettier but just may look more at peace may more look calm so I'm just happy for the changes that I've changed for myself and for you guys I'm just uh, going to work with it because it is awesome to be this fresh to start over and to be at peace okay yes so guys yes as i as you can see it dry up on my face now my face feels sticky it feels stiff it could dry a little more yeah you see it very very stiff and guys as you can see i have some something on my face this is not pimple and this is not dark spot or whatever i'm just born with them what you call them um the people them where you see this look or something them in them face i think i have some of them but yeah some of you guys might comment and say i'm very ugly i'm very ugly my skin look very spotty but i don't mind you know i look beautiful to me and i know i look beautiful to you guys too so guys i'm gonna go ahead and i'm going to wash it off now so let me just turn back this for a little bit like this yes, and i'm gonna go ahead and wash it up because it's not dry on my face it not feel that stiff me no never because me never use enough more people say use enough because i'm sure not me use enough but it's already stiff on my face and my face look real nice look you know it feels smooth it looks smooth to me it's just that because i have a little uneven complexion but it's time to wash it off okay let's go And then I'm gonna take my towel and pat again. Let me turn back the camera there. I'm sorry. Right. And I'm gonna go ahead and pat. My face looks red. <laughs> That's just how my skin is very sensitive. I'm gonna go and pat my face now. Right. And then I'm gonna go and apply the oil. So I actually have two oil. I actually have one for night it's called a dark spot remover one for night and the reason why this green thing is on it is because I actually um, put put the numbers on it so I can have them in order so this one is for night is a dark spot remover and this one is for day morning whatever so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, let me put this camera on now. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it on my forehead like that and I'm gonna rub it in and it stays on my face all day I'm gonna go again and put some on my cheeks and I'm gonna rub it in and it stays on my face all day I'm gonna go again and put some on my cheeks. I hope you guys could see it clear up. Rub it in. Mm -hmm. Make sure it go over your eyes and in the side right there on your cheek. And I'm gonna go over to the you see the difference and I'm gonna go over to the other side and just pour some from the top right there come down oh no I did run in my eye <laughs> close my eye and rub it in mm. voila voila And that's it and it actually stays on your face for the whole entire day I'm gonna look in the camera so I can look at you guys <laughs> I'm so weird so yeah this is it so this is also a dark spot remover so you just rub it in 
and it just give your face a really glow eyely look your face is gonna be this eyely for the entire day but you don't mind that you can even go on the road with your face looking like this you probably look too eyely or whatever but that's just it remember it's something that you don't rub off it's just gonna stay for the whole day and then in the night now we're gonna actually do the same thing over and over so you're continuously doing this every day until your product is finished when it's absolutely finished then now you could see the result so you, if you guys want to try probably do this for your youtube video as i am doing you just you know take a little time and you do it and you just trust the process in whatever you guys are doing you always trust the process and you will see the good results i actually start using this last night and may i tell you say I don't know what me I see my results already because me look so pretty and I have a beautiful smile. <laughs> but all about myself sometimes, I see. Yes, yeah, so guys, you should follow Modern Bee Skin on Instagram. Um, you can text her, just tell her what is your problem, and she will fix it. And I may never just get face, um, I may never just get face products. I also got body products because, as I said before, my skin is very uneven. So I want to get my skin even. I want to get this natural glow look. So I also buy a silk body butter. And I also purchase a paradise sponge. So what are these two things? You use this. This is the scrub. You use it. And you scrub your body. You don't have your skin that wet. You just have it a little damp wet. And then this is how it looks you use this on your body and it's a scrub it smells real good man no, i like to you it's not that sweet it's not so it does have this natural smell good thing and we also have the body butter when you're finished scrubbing your body you use this as a lotion and we have um what is something name where you use make porridge lord god this is very embarrassing for a jamaican i normally call it nutmeg but i don't know nutmeg a cinnamon Cinnamon something or another. <laughs> I'm sorry. Cinnamon something or another. Yeah. Smells real nice. So what you do is that you just um it's a sweat, I don't know why. You just rub it onto your body. I'm actually gonna take a shower now and apply the body product. I'm not gonna have a video for that one, you know. But thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more vlog videos from your girl Ivani Instagram Sensations. Remember to like and subscribe to my youtube channel please feel free to leave a comment and i'm gonna post my instagram name below so you guys can see and for watching more videos will be coming soon peace i'm out